Good morning, beautiful people. It's currently 6.22 in the morning. I know, right? I'm up early. I've been up since 3 o'clock. I had to take my mom to the airport. She went back out of town for work. So, today we got a pretty, pretty eventful day. But I'm not leaving the house. It doesn't involve me leaving the house. We actually got some packages in today. We got This is the first package. And... This is the second pack. This is my new night stand. In my last video, I was talking about, you know, doing my room. I know I said I was going to do a game instead of video, but that's going to have to wait. For right now, we going to put this on. I don't like the sound of that. We're going to build this. We're going to build this last. We're going to get the hard thing out the way. If you wonder what I'm talking about, this is a CPU cooler. It's, it's one of them big Sigma. So it's going to my PC. If you don't already know, I'm pretty sure I haven't explained it yet in any video so far. My PC, my CPU specifically has been running hot. I play games, it run almost to 90 degrees and I know that's bad and I don't need it to run at 90 degrees. Especially when I'm editing it sometimes, sometimes it gets hot. And I don't want it to start throttling and stuff like that. So we got a new cooler. I hit up my PC guy and I asked him, you know, I explained my situation to him. I said, hey, look, my CPU overheating, yada, yada, yada. It didn't really do that at first, but then I thought to myself, I said, you know what? Let me put more thermal paste on my CPU. So I took off the old one, put on the new, and it's still overheating. Like it started overheating with the old like thermal paste. So I just thought to myself, maybe it needs some new ones. So I'll put some new one on there. Didn't really help the situation. We're gonna try a new cooler because I still got the stock cooler. I've had this CPU for over a year. We need to unplug my PC. We're gonna take it up there and uh, dining room and use the dining table but the thing about me when it comes to my pc like i really don't like messing with anything when it comes to like my cpu i really don't but we gotta do it i mean that's my first pc i ever built like i said i do plan on upgrading right now first things first the cooler then i'm gonna get a new cpu they're coming out with a 4060 ti and i'm waiting until they come out the 12 gig the 8 gig just came out i think also remember how i said i want to put some posters around my room Order some, order like eight different posters. Order it off t though. Let's go ahead and unplug the PC so we can go ahead and set this up. gonna try something a little different today you know how i've been talking about getting an external mic we'll be using my other phone as an external mic i'm using uh samsung a54 yeah this is the external mic if the audio is ass i apologize i just use the audio from my phone but we're using this for right now so this is my pc this is um this is the fantech p300 a case i think with a b550 motherboard a ryzen 5 3600 a 3060 i'm just telling y'all the specs just in case anybody asks me for the specs like i said today's agenda is to change the cpu cooler I, honestly i don't even know why i picked up the knife i don't even need it. the barbarian rip this shit open this cooler is the Thermorite Assassin X. Me personally, I'm not a big fan of these coolers just because they so big. And judging by the size of the box, this thing is huge. So let's go ahead and unbox this, take this front panel off, and then we can get to work. So we got the front panel off. This is basically what the inside of my PC look like. It looked plain. I got no RGB fans. I really want some now. Because at first, my girl even mentioned it to me. She was like, your PC kind of plain. Fun fact, my girl helped me build my PC, even though she knows nothing about it, like at all. She don't know shit about PCs, and she helped me build it. It is kind of plain. I do need more RGB. The only RGB that I have is my RAM. And I mean, my power supply kind of shine through here, but it's only a white light, so that's it. It is kind of dusty. Not going to lie. I'm going to dust it off too it's time to get to that cpu this is the cooler this is the heat sink this shit is huge this is the fan it also came with the brackets oh it came with its own thermal paste i forgot about my thermal paste it's actually in the room but we're gonna use that one we got my cpu cool off it looked like the thermal paste was actually drying up just a little bit i mean you got like a lot on the edges so i don't think i may have put a 
lot. We're gonna go get some alcohol, clean this up. Also, for the people that don't like work on PCs, PC tip, you wanna take off your thermal paste on your CPU, use isopropyl alcohol. Now the way I usually do it, I get some Q-tips if I need to get like the small areas. Basically use a napkin on wipe like the main big area. Ran into the problem. This, this back plate, it don't want to stay. Don't know why. Like it's extremely wobbly. Like it comes out so easy. I got some electrical tape, but what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this top part, bring it down to the back plate, and I'm gonna do the same thing for the bottom, just so it can stay long enough for me to put these standoffs on. Especially with my stock cooler, it became such an issue trying to put that cooler in because this standoff did not want to stay in the hole. So we're gonna try this method, hopefully it worked. You know me, being a nigga in nigga rigging, thought of an idea that if you don't know what nigga rigging is, it's basically a black person improvising. I'm just, <laughs> it's improvision. We improvising for sure. My plan worked. I got them in. That's a good box. That box held this, it, it, it held. If I would put a little bit more pressure on it, this whole box would have crashed. I'm not gonna lie, cause you know, it got this foldable bottom, so. We good, we got this in. Now it's time to put Big Bertha Jr. in. Not using my phone right now, cause I'm working on this. But we got the CPU cooler in there. We clipped the fans on there right now. I have this RGB cable and I see it takes three pins, right? It takes three pins. So I'm just sitting there like, I'm like, what three pins could this possibly go to? Three pin like socket is all the way at the bottom. This is long enough to reach, but I didn't want to put it like across my motherboard because it looked tacky, right? So I've been trying to figure out a way to like wiggle this around, figure out where to go. I think I did. So I basically got to come through the side, like right here, come down and then come under and then put it in that socket. Hopefully it worked like that. And it looks we getting a steady 42, 45 degrees right now, which is good. I mean, normally I would just start up a game, but you know, I'm satisfied because when I start my PC up, normally it's at like I'm um, 60, close to 70 degrees. Now, as, since we do this, we're going to get started with building that nightstand. I got to plug everything up though, because my other monitors is currently off right now. All right, since we're done with that, we're going to clean off the table and then we're going to get started on that nightstand. Really hope it's not that small like the nice thing i got pretty decent inside but i really don't want it to be that small like if you seen the box the box is just completely flat obviously because it's like you know the drawers and stuff and you got to put that together but it's just it just feel it just looks so small my mama said the same thing like you sure that nice thing gotta be I'm like i hope so so let's clean this off See, I was gonna build my nightstand in my room, but I decided we might as well just come in the living room, cause why not? We it's more natural light in here. You know what I'm saying? The lights around the house really do suck. We finna get rid of the nightstand. As you can see, remember what I said about the box and how small it looked? Look at it. It just looks small. Bro, I'm getting old. It took me a minute to get down here. So I was just gonna use my phone as the mic, but since I'm so close, I just thought it was kind of stupid. If y'all hear like a humming, that's somebody truck outside. They've been sitting there for like the past 30 minutes, like just leave. So now we're about to start opening. Probably need to move my phone down a little bit farther back because you can barely see. I changed my mind. We're going to switch to this since I'm so far away from the phone. I don't really want the audio to be too echoey, so that's why I'm just using this. Instructions. We don't need those, my man. Oh, if you could have just seen what Luna just did, this motherfucker just hit some Spider-Man shit. Motherfucker jumped, boom, boom, and then jumped off the wall. What the? I don't know what's wrong with her. She got the zoomies and it's only, it's only 8.31 in the morning and she got the zoomies. Speaking of that, it didn't even take me that long to put the CPU cooler inside my PC. I'm kind of proud of myself. Maybe we should close this. This is dangerous. Although I'm a, like a very dangerous person and I do stupid shit to myself. I accidentally cut myself at work on my arm. It happened by accident. My girl always say I need to wear my gloves at work, but I work the overnight shift. Those rules don't apply to me. Before I start building, I want to talk to y'all for a second. How y'all day going? 
you know what I'm saying? Y'all day going good. Hope you're having a wonderful morning. I'm not. My back hurt. Also, I'm actually re dyeing my hair again. I didn't really dye it blonde. I just bleached it and you know it's blonde. So I mean, I mean it's basically dying it blonde, right? I'm dying it red because I was on TikTok and then I seen bro had his tips red and I was like, you know what? I want my hair red. This week I'm dying my hair. Y'all will probably see it this week or maybe next week. I don't know. Low key want to finish this and then I want to start making my other video if I'm not too tired. Cause I've been up since three o'clock because my mama flight was at six. We left the house at four. I mean, I had a can of G Fuel, but that can only last so long. I don't want to drink another one because it's kind of OD in my opinion. I don't need that much caffeine in my system. Yeah, let's go ahead and hurry up and build this. I built it, I finished it, but the problem is this shit is smallest. Like, honestly, if I was gonna put this right next to my current nightstand, you'd be like, bro, that shit kind of small. Like, literally, I could pick it up just like this. That's how small it is. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's lacking the height by four feet. Do not look. I just, I know how it looks. I got a bottle of lotion next to the bed, bro. Took a shower, okay, when I got back from the airport and I put lotion on. It's not what you think. <laughs> 